they released a very good article again talking about the nearness of the tribulation not that you need any proof of that because you've seen that and i've been talking about that for years now the widespread passion to divide jerusalem demonstrates the nearness of the tribulation joel 3 verse 2 i will also gather all nations and will bring them down into the valley of jehoshaphat and i will plead with them there for my people and for my heritage israel whom they have scattered among the nations and parted my land they have divided the land the current determination to divide the land of israel will continue as it is right now resulting in god's final judgment in joel since we already are seeing such a widespread focus and concentration on dividing the land and dividing jerusalem how close do you think the day of the lord really is the sad news is the world's preoccupation with jerusalem will lead to much suffering for the israelites and if you read revelation it's horrifying it makes the holocaust look like a practice run for what's coming two-thirds are going to feel this pain literally the good news is that a remnant will recognize Jesus as their Messiah and say, Baruch haba b'shem Adonai, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord by the end of the seven-year tribulation. Zechariah 12 verse 10 to 13 verse 9. So pray for Israel, pray for the peace of Jerusalem and know that this is one of the most difficult times ever for them in the history of mankind to be able to bring forth that remnant by the end of Daniel's 70th week. God bless and shalom.